Look, Ma, no hands. And he's in a helicopter. But he's not panicky, even though the pilot is sitting safely on the ground, some distance away from this newest whirlybird, which incorporates remote control. It's being tested for the services at Fort Belvoir, Virginia, and all kinds of uses are being thought of for the remote control copter, whose pilot can operate it from another copter or plane, or from the ground, anywhere within range of its camera eye. The passenger is just along for the ride on this demonstration flight. He's strictly a passenger, no more. Even at a time of our air age, when marvels are becoming commonplace, it's a remarkable sight and an achievement with great new potentialities, a robot workhorse of the air.